I just want to make this quick video on how you can upgrade the storage or add more storage to your HP ProBook 6360B laptop. So, um, and you can actually do this with any laptop that has an express, express card slot. So actually, I went out and uh, actually ordered this about a week ago. And this is an express card, memory card reader. So what it is, basically, it has a built-in SD card reader. And it's in an express card form factor, as you can see. So if your computer or if your laptop has an express card slot built into it, you can, you know, use this device right here. And this is a, you know, a great device to add more storage. But not only that, but you could also add a second card reader or a second SD card reader. But um, I actually purchased this because my um, card reader in this laptop actually the eject, but I guess the eject mechanism actually broke. So it's really hard. It still works, but it's really hard to remove the card because um, the card does not pop out when you press it. It just, you know, it stays in. So I decided I needed to get a, an adapter. So this is what I got. So right now I'm just going to open up and see how it works. I have I haven't even tried it yet. So I'm curious to see if it really works. And I picked this brand because it said it was plug and play. So I don't have to install any drivers or anything. And it should just work once I um, put it in a laptop. Because I actually um, purchased one. It was by Transcends. Um, yeah, I purchased one from another brand, and and uh, I think it was Transcends. And you actually had to uh, download some drivers to get the card to recognize, to get the laptop to recognize the Express card. You had to download um, a little driver, and it was really hard to find. So I decided, you know, to make sure the next one I get that it was just plug and play, as you can see. It says it right there, plug and play, hot swapping. So I hope this works. So I'm going to open it right now and see how it works. You know, again, this is, you know, a great idea for anybody who want to add more storage. Not only, you know, is it great for adding more storage, but if you have a lot of um, data or a lot of videos that you want to put on your laptop without filling up your hard drive, um, you can actually use this device here. So here we go. Looks pretty nice, nice quality. Yeah. So, you know, again, this is why I love, you know, laptops. I know now, today, they don't make laptops that have express card slots. But just having one, you know, gives you so many um, possibilities that you could do with your laptop. Not only can you add card readers like this, but you can actually add video cards. You could even add solid state drives in laptops like this just by having an express card slot. There's so many uh, functions that you can use with this. So here it is. And there's actually a difference between them, which I just found out. Um, and this is a problem, you know, I had with this laptop here because they jack mechanism I guess broke so I can't just push the car and want to eject out I have to like pull it out so I'm wondering if this is the same thing if does this automatically eject or do I have to pull out the cart so I'll just look at it real quick and I think to remove the SD card you might have to uh, remove the card reader so it goes in here Oh, okay, yes. So that's uh, it's not bad. It kind of sticks out. I can see when you put it in the cart, um, the adapter is going to be flush with the laptop, but as you can see, the cart is going to stick out a little bit. But that's not a big deal, you know, as long as it works. So I'm going to boot my laptop up and see how it works. And actually, the speed on this, this is actually um, powered by UBS. This is actually powered by USB 2.0. So it's not, you know, it's not going to be the fastest. It's not 3.0. But I believe this is supposed to transfer um, 
the transfer rate speed is 48 megabits per second so that's roughly 60 megabytes per second so it's not that fast but long as it works you know that's what I worried about see how it works so I just I'll plug this real quick and you see on the um, Pro Book 6360B, there's a express card right here. So all you do to remove this, you just press down and it pops out like this. So there you go. And with this um, slot, it actually holds both sizes. It holds the 54 millimeter, and it holds. Uh, I'm trying to think of the other size of it. Just a minute. Yeah, with this one, it holds, you know, both sides of cards. It holds the 34 millimeter and the 54 millimeter adapter. And what I have right here, this is the 34 millimeter adapter right here. And it fits in towards on the left side of the slot right here. Because this is a wide slot. It's a 54 millimeter slot. So it fits towards the left side right here like this. Let me give you a better view. And it just, there you go. Just clicks in. And then when you want to eject it, you just press on it. And it comes out. So I'll see how it works. And I think I'm going to take the car out. As you can see, the car sticks out just a little bit. So that's not really, that's not bad. See, that's not, that's pretty good. It's just enough where, you know, it doesn't stick out too much. But just enough where you could just pull it out real easy. So that's not bad. So I'm going to take it out and I'm going to boot up the laptop just to see how it works. Plug it back in. Okay, so now I hit the power. Boot up. There we go. And log in. Okay, there we are. So I can see it just recognized my card as you can see right here it says it just okay it's just plug and play you can see it says your device is ready to use so it just installed I guess the driver to read the card so it's plug and play so that's just gonna happen just one time so next time when you put it in it should just automatically read it see okay it says ready to use okay the device is ready to use so to access this, you want to click the start button. You want to go to computer. And there it is, removable disk. E, so that's the express card adapter right here. So what you do, you know, you just want to double click on it. And let's see what it says. Okay, it says please, you know, insert a disk into this drive. So I'm going to put my... Um, SD card and see what happens. There we go. Whoops. Okay, there we go. Pushed it in a little bit too hard. Okay, just scan the drive. Seems like everything's working. And this card, memory card, I do have photos on it. This is actually my memory card from my other camera, my um, Parasonic GH3. Because most of the time I film with my Sony, and that's what I'm using right now. I'm using my Sony A6000. And then you go. There you go. That's the memory card. Double click on it. Okay, there's my files. And you can see it works. So it's, this is just plug and play. You just plug it in, and it just starts up working automatically. It recognized the uh, memory card. 
So now I don't see how fast it transfer a video file. So my videos, I think, are right here. Parasonic. And I'm just take a random video file. Let's see one that's kind of large, because I want to see how long, how fast this reader is. Um. Whoa, that's too much. That's four gigs. I want something like maybe one gig. Just to test it or less. Yeah, 13 megabytes, that's a little bit short, but let's see. Okay, one gig. So I'm gonna transfer a one gig video to my um desktop on my computer. See how long it takes. I'm just gonna drag it over here. Like so. Here we go. For more detail. Okay, it says about 45 seconds. That's not bad. That's uh, pretty quick. And I just wanted to test the speed to see if it's, you know, the same speed as the SD card. I mean, the card reader that is built into this laptop. And that's pretty quick to transfer a one gig video in about 45 seconds that's pretty good so it's not really slow five seconds left oh there you go so yeah it works and it transfer video that's pretty quick even for an adapter it's uh, it's not built into the hardware of the laptop. This is just a plug and play adapter and it transferred a video file pretty quick. So that's really good. So that's about it for the video. I just made this video to show you how you can add more storage space to um, this laptop. So I hope you liked the video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Thank you. Goodbye.